students welcome to our channel learning workbook it is always fun to learn maths through activities so today in this video we will do an interesting and creative activity on how to make christmas snowflakes by using the concept of fractals for this activity we need a3 color sheets a ruler a black marker pen a pencil a pair of scissors and a glue aim of this art integrated activity is to make a beautiful christmas snowflake using the concept of fractals so let's first understand what are fractals fractals are beautiful geometrical shapes which are self similar in nature Some of the examples of fractals are shown here. This means if we take a small portion of the shape, it will look the same as original shape in its entirety. For example, take a look at this beautiful fractal called Sierpinski triangle. Each part of this fractal is similar as the original shape. You can see any part like the part highlighted here in yellow is itself a fractal or the part highlighted in red is also a fractal or even a smaller part highlighted in blue looks same as the original shape so no matter where we look we will see the same pattern over and over so never ending patterns like this that on any level of zoom look roughly the same are called fractals so students basically fractals are never ending patterns created by repeating a simple process over and over again now let's see some real life examples of fractals which are built in nature first example is a fern which repeats its pattern at various scales if you look closely you will see a branch of leaves repeating itself in a pattern some of the other examples of fractals are tree branches thunderous lightning bolt beautiful angelica flowers and tributaries and distributaries of rivers so let's start with the activity take a3 color sheet of paper and draw an equilateral triangle of each side equals to 27 cm now carefully cut out this triangle using pair of scissors now students repeat the previous step and cut out one more equilateral triangle of same size now using glue paste these triangles on each other to form a star as shown here length of each side of the star will be 9 cm now students repeat these previous steps and form one more star of same size so in total we have created four equilateral triangles to form two red stars now take another a3 color sheet of paper and draw six equilateral triangles with each side equals to 9 cm then students carefully cut out these triangles using pair of scissors now we have six equilateral triangles of each side equals to 9 cm but we need 12 equilateral triangles so students repeat this previous step and form six more equilateral triangles of same size students now paste these blue triangles on middle of each side of the red star as shown here 
you will notice that length of each side of the snowflake is now 3 cm. Next, take another A3 colored sheet of paper and this time draw 30 equilateral triangles of each side equals to 3 cm. Then, carefully cut out these triangles with the help of a pair of scissors. So students, we have got 30 equilateral triangles of side 3 cm. Next, paste these green triangles on the middle of each side of vector snowflake as shown here. You will find that length of each side of the snowflake is now 1 cm. Now students, our vector snowflake is complete but to make it look beautiful, paste the remaining 6 blue triangles on the top of each blue triangle as shown here. In the end, paste the second red star on the top to get a beautiful fractal snowflake. Students, you may decorate this fractal snowflake as you wish. Students, you may try making these fractal snowflakes with other beautiful color combinations. So, do try this interesting and creative activity to learn the concept of vectors in a fun way. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, then do hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel Learning Notebook and make sure to press the bell icon. Thank you. Bye-bye. See you in the next video.